With gastric cancer or stomach cancer, most patients, believe it or not, don't have any symptoms in the early stages, which is the worrying part of the disease. By the time that most patients actually have symptoms, they are usually in the latter stages, stage 3 or stage 4, um, stomach or gastric cancer. Those symptoms usually involve early satiety, loss of appetite, loss of weight, nausea, vomiting, and perhaps even noticing blood in the stool um, or even vomiting blood. In the early stages, they may present with abdominal pain. A lot of patients who picked up with early stage gastric cancer actually do so just because they've come in for gastric cancer screening or they've gone for a screening score by chance and they picked it up on, on those occasions. I think at this point in time, there actually is no guidance uh, specifically for gastric cancer screening. Unlike colon cancer screening, there is no brief encouraged to go for gastric cancer screening. However, you know that um, the single most important risk factor for gastric cancer is Helicobacter pylori infection. Now, about 30 to 40 percent of Singaporeans have this bacteria. So, if you have a family member who has Helicobacter pylori, or a family member who has stomach cancer, or even have been having symptoms for more than three months, I would encourage you to come see us for a discussion, at least.